happening it out we uh, we haven't actually said anything about sony because we've, we've been kind of roundabout saying stuff about Sony. but i feel like we've talked like you've seen a sony show right you've seen like okay there's horizon they're not gonna show horizon i don't think there's anything that they, they're gonna surprise us with this year i i feel like sony has they've got their games in the works we kind of know them you know what's going to be coming out this year and, and next year actually i don't know what this year for sony i don't know man i, I don't know i got, got to work on uh delayed to 2022 got delayed. Right? yeah, yeah to mm-hmm. 2022 uh and, and then, then... Sorry. i don't know yeah i actually don't, I don't know, know actually, actually if we think about it we don't really know a lot of because sony's got to sell these ps5s right so yeah. uh, unlike unlike microsoft where they don't they don't need to sell these xboxes they don't have to they got they can just put it out on anything yeah i mean they still want to sell them but you know sony they need to sell the box they gotta sell the actual physical box and I, here's what he was here's like a pipe dream announcement for for sony actually mm-hmm. if they bring their own game pass competitor I mean, so they, not, i'm been not talking, talking about, about i'm not talking about ps now i'm talking like Proper, I think that's I think that's what yeah. they've been kind of hinting at. Well, you know, sources have been saying is it's yeah. more of a PS Now thing. Do you think that they can actually do a actual Game Pass like service? Yeah, that's because not streamable. Are... That's downloadable. Because you can already download some PS Now games. You can, you can right. download certain PS Now games. Technology exists. I, and um, I mean, I guess technically you download PS Plus games. Exactly. And if your PS Plus subscription expires you lose the license lose for those license. games you download and just like oh you want if you want to play this game either resub to uh plus or straight up buy it so they already have the licensing kind of back end for that kind of thing so you know that they could would, do it they, they I mean, could do they it could. they, they could really just could say do like, it. hey you you have this tier of of ps plus if you use this tier uh you get access to all of these rotating games of you know this library that you can download from plus but if you have because that's what's gonna get kind of tricky and i think games with gold and game pass kind of had this issue a little bit too it's like why why have one like one of them doesn't even make sense anymore you know what i mean yeah so games with gold was like the free games you download you keep them forever and then game Pass is the rotating netflix kind of thing right Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. um i believe uh sony could do the same thing they could actually i mean it would su- it sucks for ps plus members don't get me wrong but i think sony could do the thing where they're like you no longer get these games to keep um these four games to keep per month you just got just just pay for you know our service and you have this bigger library you can download these games to your hard drive but once we pull them you lose the license for these games that would be uh that would be an interesting thing i think that if they did it that would be the best way to do it but i i i will say that they will do it with ps now to push that service i, I mean yeah, but you know, but I, you know I, what hold up hold yeah. up what if they just sweeten the deal we've seen some cool things and we kind of talked about it before you know how they they do pretty much have the anime business in the u.s overseas yeah, like, they, they, like it's like anaplex own, Crunchyroll. they um, own country and yeah exactly yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. so they, they have a bunch of stuff there what if we see some sort some sort of video service put with uh games, games. Yeah, if, i mean i, I, if I it's think ps now plus plus a crunchy roll subscription thrown I, in i there. think that would be crazy I, I i think there's a pretty big uh crossover between i feel like okay here's the thing i think people that that play games are likely to watch anime but people that watch anime aren't Uh-oh. necessarily like no i don't necessarily like no no it, it's true it's true this is something i learned in college i was just like and it's if you go to an anime convention not all the people there are going to be playing games if you go to a game go convention, to game convention a lot of people are going to watch, watch anime, yeah, anime. watch anime it's so strange it's so i i don't get it but it's a thing yeah so okay here's the thing so i think it would i think that would be that would have tremendous value to a lot of people who play games um if you did like oh you you pay for this you get you know essentially like a ps now kind of thing plus country roll and was it what do you say like funimation was it or funimation yeah it's funimation too yeah um so that'd be kind of cool but here's the question what do you charge for it i think at that i think at that level they if they were to do something like that right what do you charge for that isn't going to get people pissed 70. that's a pretty good value for 70 raising it by 10 bucks only 70 dollars a year a year a year and i agree no i agree with you 70 a year and what i'm thinking is that that 
that service that you were talking about that's yeah. a Game Pass like thing where you can download because we know PS Now is specifically for PS3 and PS2. It's it's a backwards and M- 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 PC. Oh sorry, M- I'm sorry. Um, those games, yeah, PS- yeah, the it, games, the games, yeah, PS2, PS3, right, right. right. So yeah. you would get you would get like the old catalog essentially for PS Now streaming. You would get like maybe some sort of anime kind of limited anime subscription where maybe you can't do uh, weekly episodes like oh, on so the dot, think- but you can get sure, like. Sure. You think it's like a nerfed Crunchyroll it's premium? It's a nerfed, yeah. Or maybe it's like a nerfed premium that it's still good. And so then you have like, that, that, that Game Pass. That That's okay, a killer yeah. deal. That would be yeah. killer. And that's the, all stuff in their catalog. Yeah. Two, and, two things they don't need to worry about. They just need to read it and negotiate. Year, but, I, think, I think that's, that's extremely that's a, um, competitive. That would bring people... Yeah. How much is Crunchyroll per month if you choose to pay monthly? It's like 15 a month or something like that? I, I, I feel don't like know. it's 15 or so. Yeah, so like what if the equivalent was like twenty a month? Like you could pay you could pay monthly for twenty or you could do a year for like seventy to mm. between seventy two and eighty. Like I think I think it's fine. Yeah. I, I think the, the the you know the crunch roll thing, that's that's something that just sweetens the pot. It, it might not necessarily bring more people in, but it's just one of those things like because I think that's where they're gonna look at it. It's like, does this sell actively sell more subscriptions or is it just kind of like eh? You know, I think that's what whatever they do, they're gonna look at it from that point of pers- that point of view. I think it'll just eh kind of thing, but it will just be really cool for me, for us few anime people in the U.S. Because yeah. in the U.S., like all those services are so separate, anyways. Like having yeah. it in one place and would be nice. would be. I th- nice. I think the the problem that Sony would face uh, undoubtedly with that service is attempting to roll it out worldwide because Ooh, of yeah, licensing because of licensing issues. Yeah, because of licensing issues yeah. for the anime. Yeah, yeah. So they, they, it's best that they stick with with games i mean there was a time when sony could have done some crazy crap i mean we, we i mean we still have sony music sony music is still a thing i don't think anyone's gonna be like hey i wait, want sony, sony it, music you, stuff wait really wait, wait is sony music gone so sony as oh. a label is still here but they don't distribute music like digitally Do they, anymore i, I remember sony had their service called i believe it was called music unlimited it was a competitor to like i think it's gone now it's i think that's now right yeah i think that's it yeah 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 yeah, I think they they try to do something with PSP and that, but I don't know. Anyway, that that no, that would have been see if that see, hadn't see died. Sony 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 had like a bunch of stuff that if they just yeah. gotten on their their horse, done it right, they could if have been just sitting died, on some can you crazy imagine, crap. Can you imagine paying like eighty? We're going higher now. Can, can you imagine? <laughs> paying, going, yeah. Can you imagine <laughs> like E3 eighty a twenty twenty? Yeah, you, you get you get games, <laughs> anime, and music. Like that's. My life right that there. Would like, have honestly, been, like legitimately, that's actually like my my, my life right there. So th- that I could, would have been pretty yeah. amazing. That would have, yo, that would have, hey, hey, yeah. Sony, dropped the ball. <laughs> yeah. I, I think that that's pretty much it. I, we didn't talk about EA. Mm-hmm.